Let's get this over with and blow this berg. Who called us here anyway? Crew's daughter, Rain. Crew had a daughter? Crew? Reproduced? Ew! Can you imagine what that tub of jelly must look like? Thank you for coming to Crass City. It looks like some didn't make it. Ah, well. I'm Rain. Before Father died, his wishes were simple. To have his will played for his closest associates, and for us to drink to his passing. This special vintage he kept for the very occasion, to toast his death. Here's to old friends, and to Father's untimely death. <sighs> so without further delay, his message to us. Hello, nearly friends, and mostly enemies. If you're listening to this message, then I must be dead. Oh, well. As you all know, I loved racing almost as much as I loved weapons. Alas, I never fulfilled my living dream of winning the biggest race of all, the Crass City Grand Championship. But even in death, I will field the greatest racing team ever assembled and win the biggest race on the planet. You are the best of the best, and you will race for me. Never no Forget it! I expect you're all riled up by now, so let me tell you why you will race, and you will win. If all went as planned, you just give a touching toast in my honor. Sorry to say, but I put poison in that special vintage. Quite unsporty, I may remember. Father! This is where Rain probably gets upset. Sorry, dear. It's a slow-acting poison, or you'd already be dead. You have just enough time to finish this year's racing season. If you race for me and win, my associates will provide you each with an antidote to the poison. Simple, eh? What the hell did you do to us? Please, I, I didn't know. I drank it too. Father never did play favorites. Yeah? Well, your father's crazy. We're all crazy for coming here! I think she's telling the truth. Well, it's been one minute, so I figure by now you're all arguing about how to get out of this mess. My advice is trust no one. Win the race and save yourselves. Chuck, next time you invite me to one of your little parties, don't! We can do this. We can race. And we can beat Crew at his own game. Father bought us the best mobile racing garage money can buy. And each of you has a racing car waiting. We're in this together. So let's get to it. It's been a while since you raced, Jack. So let's take your vehicle out on the track and I'll go over the basics. Hit the gas, Jack. Brakes are there when you feel the urge, but knowing you, they won't be the first thing on your mind. Hit the brake, Jack. Holding down the brake will stop your racer and put it into reverse. Hit reverse, Jack. Good. Feel the controls? Your racer has great steering response. And trust me, you'll need it for some of the more challenging courses. Green Eco powers your vehicle's damage control. When you pick up Green Eco, you repair damage on your vehicle. Not bad, you finished your first training. Get ready for the next round. Feels nice to be back in the saddle, huh, Jack? Okay, take the vehicle out for a spin and let's see what you've got. Pick up some blue eco. Watch your turbo meter for how much juice you've got in the tank and use it when you really want to burn up the track. Your meter says you've got turbo power. Use it, Jack, and drop the hammer. Oh yeah, now that's speed. Trust me, you'll need it.
Now you've mastered turboing. Let's move on to the next round of training. You can use the e-brake to get into a power slide on turns. You'll need to use power slides to get around aggressive corners. Try getting into a slide, Jack. Now hold the brake down, turn, and hang on! Great, nice slide. You can pull a 180 turn by holding down the emergency brake. Get up to speed and give it a try. You're looking good. If you want to catch a little air, use the car's jump jets. Jump jets give you a little boost off the ground when you need it and will maximize your hang time. Try jumping, Jack. Picking up Eco will power up your car and give you lots of options while you race. Try picking up a little yellow Eco. When you pick it up, the Eco will be processed and an energy weapon will come online. An icon will appear telling you what weapon you've got. That icon means you have missiles. There are different weapons Yellow Eagle will give you, and the icons tell you which one you currently have available. Each weapon is unique, and each has strategic advantages in different situations. You'll have to experiment with each type to find your favorites. You also have a dark eco meter. You can power that up by using your weapons. The more you use them, the higher the meter will go. The higher the dark eco meter, the more powerful your weapons will get. Eco makes your weapons more powerful until you crash. Bubba cry. about Yellow Eco, let's move on. Okay, let's try something new. Red Eco is for rear weapons. Try picking up Red Eco. That icon says you now have a Red Eco mine. You can activate a red-powered weapon with its own special fire button. Remember, this button will only discharge red weapons, and they go out the back. Try dropping a mine, Jack. Good job! That'll give someone a headache. Oh no! Some of Mizo's gang are on the track! Look out! He's launched the missile! Drop a mine as a counter move! Nice!
right, you've completed your training. Now let's see if you can hang with the big boys. Here's your first new vehicle, Jack. This one's built for speed. And when the need calls for something a little more rugged, choose this one. <laughs> 